Welcome back to my channel, everybody. It is me. It is I, D. Uh, I didn't do an introduction video for this because we're just going to go full throttle and you know it's going to be a good thrift trip when you see an Easter vest. Nope, I did not get it. And I'm going to leave it up to your imagination to uh, see which of these pieces I might have brought home or if any. Uh, mainly I was looking for tops on this trip and because it's summertime and in Texas that means basically we're at 105 degrees. I'm looking for very, very minimal heavy fabrics, bright colors in my color wheel. I am a winter jewel tone so hang on until the end to see if I even got anything like that, if I stuck to the point, or if I got something totally different. Um, you know, that just happens. But tons of Y2K pieces here at this store, and I just had a great time looking through and seeing. And if you are a 2000s kid, then you will know what I'm talking about. Have fun, and I'll see you at the end. Hi, chickadees. I am here with, it is May, um, the May thrift store highlight of the month. Um, I'm here with my reusable bag and I want to just do a quick little haul because this month's thrift store highlight is a classic thrift store that I think a lot of maybe the viewers or people that might watch this would shop at, which is Goodwill. I have the luckiest placement for my house being between two Goodwills. Um, the Goodwill that I will be taking a haul from and highlighting this month is the smaller one. It is um, Goodwill uh, off right off of Cooper and gosh, is it can't remember the cross street but I will in some sort of information put it up here but um, one of the goodwills that I go to often because it's so close to everything that I go to on this side of Arlington and then there's another one right by my school so let's go ahead and take a look at what I got mostly clothing um, I've been really limiting myself on home goods that I get just because I have plenty of home goods for myself and for the pop-up shop so let's start with some of the clothing. Okay. 
So I got this, uh, I must say before I do show, uh, my main focus right now when I go thrifting is summer. I am in Arlington, Texas and temperatures have already gotten to the 90s. So everything that I've tried to get or that I'm currently looking for is summer, whether it's school appropriate or like summer break appropriate. So this first very cute um, embroidered daisy tank top. And let me look at if it has the brand art class. So it is a target target brand. I got it for a dollar 79. So way cheaper than, you know, normal store prices. If I have not already said on my channel, I am a dance teacher. And when I got this, I gasped out loud. You know, if you're a thrifter and you go a lot, you see some of the same things or you know what you're gonna find when you shuffle through the racks. And this one caught my breath away or took my breath away, I should say. So it says dancer and it has uh, what I feel like is probably the Polaroid. Um, it also could be pride, but I got this for $2.29 and the brand is Sugar and Bruno. And Sugar and Bruno is a dance, I guess I would call it a dance um, t-shirt or swag company. They have bags, they have t-shirts, they have joggers, skirts, and so this, I was like, yes, yes. I told my students about it and I cannot wait to wear it. It's a little oversized, which is just what I need. All right, another summary, um, could be a school appropriate top, but definitely the crop top feel, another embroidered center with the celestial design. And I got this for $2.29 as well, and it is Awake, the Awake brand. I do not know much about that brand, but it's 5% spandex, uh, 57 cotton, and 38% polyester. So I love a good um, tie-dye, but I also liked that it had a little detail there. This is one of my true blue colors. I got it for $5.49. And it really reminds me of the like Y2K poncho style. It's got arm holes, but I thought I could really layer this up with different colored tank tops under it. Kind of like what I'm wearing right now, but like either yellow or red or purple or just white or another blue for a monochrome. So I'm excited to wear that to school. Um, layering. On the hunt for some mid-30s year old appropriate shorts and these are H&M brand. They've got a little tie around but I don't even know what kind of fabric this is. It says 100% like a cell. Wow I have never heard of that. But it's almost a linen-y, very, I mean, it's not thin. Um, that's kind of why I stay away from linen because in the summer, if you sit down, then your shorts are stuck to you. So I got these for $4.79, like I said, H&M brand, and we'll go with everything um, in the summertime. Okay, I had, what was I gonna mention about this? Oh, at my last, thrifting outing with my mom in last month's video, actually this month's video because I got it out late, but I had found a Universal Thread, another Target brand, a Universal Thread, yellow kind of layering jacket. This is also Universal Thread, $4.49. Um, I thought I could layer this with tights at school. Um, it has pockets. And at school I wear a mic so that I'm able to project and talk over music while dancing. And so, um, you know, a little more feminine. I say feminine, but it's also a very unisex style dress with the collar and the pockets, but I can layer some um, colored tights with it, jewelry, um, you know, maybe even, I don't know, some scarves, because I have scarves, but that I haven't styled or worn. A more professional style top I got it is C&E brand 
size, sorry, yeah, size medium, $4.49. These are some of my, I guess I would say true red and raspberry colors. And it has a little button snap or button pull in the back, just flowy to where I can dance and still seem like I look like a teacher every now and then. All right, I scored with this. Um, recently, I don't know, maybe not even recently, but Banties had come way, 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 way back in style. And I found this, I might have gasped out loud as well, but Pink Floyd tee, I wish it was a little bigger because it's a size small, but it's Pink Floyd officially licensed product. So I have no idea where this would have originally come from. I don't know if it's like Hot Topic or it could be a Target thing. I'm not quite sure, but it looks like it's got some good wear and tear and I got it for $2.29. I'll probably cut it a little bit. Um, and when I say cropped, my friends, my, my chickeny friends, when I say cropped for me, that's like where it's gonna hit my waistline and not where it's gonna go up here. Um, I'm just not young enough for that anymore. As I say in my fancy British accent. Okay, y'all might think I'm crazy, but I feel like the best season to get Christmas clothing is now. Um, that's my one hot tip for this haul video. And I found this a bit. I found this for $5.49 and I will definitely be wearing this during the holidays. It's def it's a true red color. It's got this sweet little embroidered uh, snowflakes around with beads and then on the back it's got a cute snowflake design and then all over. I am definitely going to wear this to school um, and it's in really great condition. It's designer's original studio. Joy, America Limited. And I believe that's it for the haul. I do feel, I'll show this just because, but um, at another Goodwill recently, I had gotten this Talbot's skirt, $4.79. Um, one of my blue colors and just trying to get more skirts for summer rather than just shorts to dress it up a little bit with my band tees or whatnot. And uh, I found that one. That was the only thing I got while at the thrift store that time um, at the Goodwill. But that is it. Um, I gave you a, a nice little thrift tip, but at the beginning I also talked to you about my reusable bags. These I keep in my car every day, every single day. And I use them every single day for something whether it be for school, for groceries, for thrifting, for just organizing things. And especially now at the end of the year when I'm gonna be taking stuff home um, to store over the summer, these bags come in handy so much. So if you're not taking your reusable bags, I feel like that could start to make the world of a difference. Hope you enjoy this quick little haul with some summer items. I'm looking forward to seeing you on Instagram, sharing your summary items if you, that's what you're shopping for in your area. Speaking of Instagram, if you don't already follow me there, it is chickadee underscore exchange. And I'd love to meet you and talk with you. I love talking thrifting, gardening, uh, dancing, photography, crafting, you name it. And speaking of gardening as well, before I end this video, would anyone be interested in seeing uh, the gardening side of our lives here? If you do, please leave me a comment below or comment to find me on Instagram. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks, I'll see you next time, chickadees.